it's just like that so there was what we did here um if you look closely right here we, we we placed a connector right here something like this that can enable us losing this pipe here yeah, that's i uh, we can actually lose this place um, out from here separated then we can wash down there straightly to flush the water just out from that place and from here again guys down to this place if you look closely you can see another right here this was just newly um we placed this thing just new here so we can also wash comfortable because if the pipe is just straight down it's actually going to be very hard for us to actually wash this just like that so we flushed all this pipe and with the use of virusin so guys we know that this virusin is very very active okay for viral diseases and you know we have been struck with salmonella and you know this coccidiosis so looking right here is the virusin okay this is the virusin we we'll actually just add like maybe three of this red um cover inside here then put with normal clean water then we flush it out so after that we just have to lose here then we wash this after every medication we actually have to wash this then if you look currently here there's actually a joint here we have to loosen from this angle and loosen from here also to wash this properly like very very well because the pipe was so dirty so guys and we have given them antibiotics for at least two weeks so you can easily tell how it's going to be and this is different types of vaccines okay so that's what we did and what else um, after we remove these liters so guys you can see we're making use of uh, more of wood shavings currently you can see instead of the sawdust it was actually mixed together but you can see the wood shavings is actually going to help us so guys we changed the position of our um lane boxes um you know when we move before um there was no space right here okay so currently now there's space because i saw a dead bed back of these lane boxes when the lane boxes was um placed on this wall they were there was a dead bed the bed died i saw it just back of this place like this dead it was stuck back there so right currently you can see space i can actually move right here and i place another drink at this strategic point but when these beds have walked along i can just come here and have water then you can see another place very cool for them to stay you can see most of them roasting on here so guys this is just how i try to do it so the beds can have enough way to walk if you should in case there's pecking incident and maybe they are trying to fight they can look for a very good way to run out looking right here again is another spacing from this angle you can just move out here like this you can get a very good walkway right here again it was i just had to remove it from the wall totally so i can be able to see anything that is just there i'm actually planning to take it up like i'll place a block under here a brick block then i'm going to carry this um lane box and place on the um the the block and so guys another thing again i have actually helped us was lighting program so guys you can see those light there you can see that light currently there you can see this again this light is always on during the night so it can help our bed to actually eat very very well but during this period they were they lost weight so we need them to gain their body weight back both in the morning and in the night there was food round so if they were fortunate to eat all the food before the night then that's good and something else we also do like i said about these 10 liters here right here these both of them are actually 20 liters 10 and 10 before we go in for the night or for the day we're actually going to fill it up with water and mostly vitamins okay you can see vitamins right there they're almost done with it we place more of vitamins for them to drink we're actually going to give them strength okay so guys that is actually what we do to make sure these beds come by you can see they're actually pecking this bed right here and i um they're just actually pecking this bed it's actually having this um foul box you can see when you look closely to the bed but it's nothing we've already vaccinated them so um it's nothing to panic about but you know these beds keep on pecking on the injuries of this bed and you know it's making them to feel uncomfortable that's eating quite enough because i'm trying to let's feed here in the crop of the beds 
yeah so i'm just allow, I'm going to allow it be for now it's actually scared that they are actually going to pick it so guys it's actually taking water so that is how we managed to solve most of this problem and currently when we take this litter it was just very hard part of this it was so 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 hard guys we spent most hours in here Because you know our liters is very high so i'm actually going to be adding to it over time you know when these birds are actually dropping the liters begin to increase okay and now again so what a good thing about this lighting program that i noticed is um our beds um, usually lay more of the eggs by um noon that was back then for this incident but currently with the help of the light system and the water they are giving them two four seven okay they are now laying very early yeah before um 12 like that you'll be able to see some amount of eggs which we don't actually have before okay so guys like i said there's a lot of lot of things to actually say that happen during these times so i'm actually going to say it out here for everybody to know so you will not encounter this incident honestly it's so terrible because of feed you know this feed cost all this okay so that's why I said you might vaccinate your birds against an incident, but when like the mycotoxins is very very dangerous to the health of the birds, it actually breaks the immunity. So that was how it came in. Yes, it's actually an immunity disease that will destroy the intestines of this bird. That was what killed most of our birds. The intestines were weak. Yes, and the GIT, which is where the feeds do stay extremely weak yes the gizzards become green and just like that so guys that is just how it is so um with the help of god currently our birds are getting well like they are well yes they are just well and fine so we are just tackling the production and we're actually going to give them this vitamin for about seven days okay they are just going to be on vitamins which is normal it's just help them consume a lot of water and you know eat more so guys looking currently right here you can see 1000 dose of lasota so i'm actually going to give my beds now okay my beds are 400 plus so i'm actually this is actually a double dose to boost the immune system you so we can have more strong immunity so you can see i'm actually going to get um you can see this picnic as well so this is to use um to dilute it as well just a huge pick you know this peak is very good and it's of high quality so i'm just going to add it to this 10 liter it's 10 liter right here i'm going to mix it i want to double dose it like i said so it can boost my bed immune system they're actually going to come up very fast so this is used to boost the immune system at its double dose you can see these beds are so so tasty they're trying to pass their heads out here you can see um so we have to, we just tap them with water for about two hours so um they can be very tasty so it's actually going to work effectively okay so so we are just done missing the lasuta okay so this is the pig the pig milk um you have to open four rounds like this then can stay very well guys you can see these birds right here are so 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 thirsty okay so we have actually we use this manual drinker so it's actually going to be very easy for us so after that the our vitamins actually waiting for us so after this um 
vaccine we are actually going to open her up so the water can actually flow back you can see them drinking water so so much we really stuff them very very well you can see So guys, catch you up on the next upload.